welcome to another Photoshop tutorial from tutorvid.com. This one's going to go over the burn tool. To get to the burn tool, press the letter O or over here and select it. Make sure you are on the burn tool and not the dodge or the sponge tool. To get these other options, you have to press that little arrow in the bottom corner. So on burn tool, your settings are up here. The first box here is the brush size, selected similar to uh, the regular brush. Next is the range, the shadows, midtones, or highlights, which color levels it's going to affect. The shadows, it'll only affect the dark areas. If I burn now here, not much happens because it's on a white area. If I select the highlights, however, you can see that that area gets darker. If I select the shadows and go up here, this area will get darker. But if I select highlights and burn up here, then nothing happens. Exposure is how fast it affects the image. If I set it at low exposure, which is what you generally want to do to make the edits smooth, and uh, for shadows, it makes the burning a lot more smooth. Uh, if you want the brush to act like an airbrush, you click this button. Protect tones, you generally want that selected. That keeps the color values more accurate when you're dodging and burning. That's it. Check out more tutorials on tutorvid.com.